everybody. Welcome to the Mystic Tavern, the only place that does it on purpose when they Wait. jump out of the frying pan into the fire. Wait, why isn't it working now? Oh, no. Oh, now it's working. There we go. Boop, boop. Okay. The after the fire is Avernus. But how did we get to Avernus, guys? I how don't it's even made. remember. Well, it all started in a little town called Greenest, didn't it? Come on. Was it Greenest? Greenest was the town in which hmm. uh, several characters found themselves locked up in the Greenest Jail, in the Keep. Uh, this was before my time. Yes, this was before our dear Bam, oh. Bam Brain Smasher, uh, Bam Smasher uh, <laughs> time. Um, those characters, among them, the only one remain that is <laughs> Sneak currently. Um, uh, that they were let out as long as they helped with the ensuing draconid attack um, among the town. Um, there was a great warrior guard that was with them, whose name I can't remember. Um, but he was just like a random dude, and a big dragon flew overhead, and the, the dude rolled. Fucking that's when he got it right in the eye. It was great. Wow. Um, oh, God, and then he died shortly please after. don't tell me that was Sneak's inspiration. <laughs> that might be, honestly. <laughs> Um, oh god it was that far back <laughs> the guard did die um and Hero. we we were all very sad um and then bam showed up no i showed up before that oh bam showed up before that i was literally the second game yeah and well long story short they helped as many people as they could um and then bam showed up or before that, Bam showed up. And then... Um, Fig died. Fig died, which was a Furbolg S Ranger. Still got that bow. Still really got the bow. Like, I would have delivered it by now if I wasn't in hell. Um, and then a alchemist by the name of Maruza Volcon uh, joined the team uh, of now three players. Um oh. No Back time. then, we didn't know how many lives Maruza had. It's not time for cuddles, like it's time for stream story. Um, yeah. So, no, dickhead, go away. <laughs> Cat problems. <laughs> Keep talking, <laughs> Callum. <laughs> <laughs> oh, no. Where's he gone? Wait, what? Long boy. Long boy. We have an escaped cat on stream. Oh no. Oh dear. Technical difficulties. <laughs> right, so. Cat on the loose. So, <laughs> Marusa joined, and he was after information about the dra dragon cult because uh, they had taken his husband, Leosin, um, to their camp after Leosin went to try and do some reconnaissance. So, the party are free. Managed to make their way into the dragon. Uh, the dra the dragonoids <laughs> camp. It is this is this the camp this is where, where Bam went it. invisible? Bam went it. invisible. Yeah. I remember listening to that. <laughs> it was brave. I literally just walked this off. This was like session this... four. Um, mm. Bam went into the camp invisible, whilst mm -hmm. the other two talked to some kobolds. And got them on their side, kind of, by, by feeding them stuff. Um, I distinctly remember trying to put a tent on fire and failing miserably. And then... Um, oh, actually, I'll tell you what I can do. Because I realised that I've been talking and I haven't had a light-up situation. Mm. There, we, there we go. Oh, no. <laughs> <laughs> so, um, yeah. So we got the kobolds on our side. Bam managed to untie Leosin's bonds whilst the other two were distracting Cyanrath, a half dragon bastard who killed Fig in the second or third episode. Uh, mm -hmm. Yep. Um, Leosin got away. We saved him. We got out. We went back to Greenest. The Lord tells us that. Dragon Cult in the exact same camp actually stole his golden shit, so we had to go and find the, the treasure back uh, into the Dragonoid camp after they'd mostly cleaned out and moved on. 
Which reminds me, at what point did we lose the other three? Somewhere before we I got to the I think he camp. lost them before Fig's death, right? No, no, no. It no, was, no, it was, it was after Fig's death. It was just before was the it? camp. Yeah. Okay. Um, and, yeah, well, they, 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 they missed out because they, they had other stuff they had to do. Anyway. Yeah. Um, where was I? So, yeah, we go back to the camp and they've mostly cleared out. There was a couple of rangers knocking about um, that were sort of just providing food for the journey um, by obviously hunting. And we made our way through a cave. We managed to see Sirenraf's second in command, who I can't remember the name of, but she was a she was a banner bearing knight of some sort. And uh, <laughs> we knocked her down a secret passage hole by mistake, complete mistake. Uh, and uh, we went down the secret passage hole, which was like a hole in the ground. Um, mm -hmm. And uh, that's when we saw Sai and Rav coming. And we know we can't fight him because he killed Fig in one hit. So we climb up the passage hole again. We chop the rope. We uh, throw a bunch of stuff down, like ball bearings and 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 lots of do you, grease. Do you still have the picture of it? I do. Hold on. Wow. Um, that was like a defining thing for the trio. That was that <laughs> was eyes. the day the day that we fucked everything up. No, <laughs> <laughs> it's on stream. Hey. Um, <laughs> So, this is before guys? Bam had his hat. Hello, we're telling the oh, story so that? far. Okay. Cool. <laughs> so, Rap died a bloody and horrible death. <laughs> <laughs> to pots and pans of ball bearings and bear traps and grease and fire. <laughs> and, um, yeah, so that that. And then happened. we fell down a hole and got into a verse. <laughs> Well, fast forwarding a little bit, you know, we went to yeah. Alterel, we helped out around there. We no, helped no, one... I'm telling of the abridged version now. Oh, <laughs> Tavius Krieg, we helped him to get to Alterel, but then Alterel blew up, which was not good. Um, mm. And then we went to Baldur's Gate. We met Magnus and Alum, two uh, yeah. two uh, chosen of Helm, it would seem. Um, uh, some other stuff happened, yada yada yada. We got to a verse. <laughs> <laughs> we we met everyone. Like, okay. Along the way, I know, but I want to yeah. play now. <laughs> <laughs> you come a long way. Yes. Interesting. Indeed. I also forgot how much I'd listened to at the start. Like I thought there would been loads that I'd missed, but I haven't. Like noise. Really just drop out. No. Okay, you. I know. Your thing drops off the. Okay, cool. She doesn't want to be seen. We're blaming the cats. Sorry to keep you waiting there, anyway, guys. That's all right. Okay. It's okay. It's been good. It's okay. Whoop. We got to. Ow. We got to tell the story. Of well, half the story. Yeah. <laughs> Tune in next time. This is the story of Balamori and how they got to. <laughs> oh no! It's gonna be so <laughs> bad. Now. Yada yada yada, we went to Candlekeep, got transported to Elterel by an otter. Helterel mm -hmm. in Averna. As you do. Yeah. <laughs> by an so otter. I mean, and like, we also met Ephraim and Truffles there too. Yeah. Oh, and, and Marisa very... died at one point. Yeah. That's, that's funny. The first, Two points. First time? Yeah. The first, first time. First time. <laughs> <laughs> the, the first time he died. <laughs> We're now potentially on the third. Mm. Oh yes. Um. Yeah. So yeah, they had various small adventures in El Troll before realizing that what they needed to do was on Avernus proper. Made their way down from the floating city, and uh, met Mad Maggie, where they've been helping out around the uh, the fort. Got some memories from Truffles. And then the base was attacked by um, Magma, the third clone, shall we say, of Magnus and Alum. Third chosen of Helms. 
this one turned into a tiefling uh, because uh, this was the, the aspect of Magnox <laughs> that was, uh, yeah, exactly, um, that was split off from Magnus and Alan by Ontar Froom. Uh, oh. 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 We, we know this, don't we? No. Um, no. <laughs> I mean, this is yes, no. Totally. Sure. <clears throat> oh, I thought I'd done this, but <laughs> never mind. <laughs> uh, I mean, yes, yeah. of course we know this. I mean, I guess realistic. Oh no, but Mag Magnus and Alum did both meet Magna whilst fighting mm. on Tar. Yeah. Yeah. Uh, or oh, whilst Magma was fighting on Zora's one. Oh. Well. Mm. Oh, I was, for the sure I'd, I was sure I'd RP'd that bit. Okay. Cool. <laughs> GG. Never mind. Pretend <laughs> you didn't it's, hear that. It's fine. Our viewers great, can go back and listen DMing to all the streams here. and uh, tell us where no, they can't. Right. We only started recording them like what, a couple months no. ago. No. <laughs> <laughs> um. Anyway, yes, so uh, it was split off from uh, Magnus and Alan. Um, hmm. Okay. Uh, yeah, anyway, um, so yeah, you fought Magma and also a uh, Abishai that looks suspiciously like Maruza that you realized halfway through the fight probably was Maruza. Um, I mean, that might be the concussion. Hmm. <laughs> Uh, all of you have, apart from Alum. I think Alum was the only one that yeah, didn't go down. Yeah, but you don't care. He's just like... <laughs> like... <laughs> if it bleeds, we can kill it. Mm -hmm. <laughs> um, so yeah, anyway, you, you repelled the invaders to, to Mad Maggie's Fort, Fort Knucklebone. And um, Knucklebone. after you've dealt with uh, the main guys, you look around you and you see that... Uh, Mad Maggie's forces, the Red Caps, uh, her followers, uh, the Flame Skull, the uh, Flesh Golem, uh, the two Kenku are all repelling their own parts of the battle uh, that were raging around you. Mm -hmm. And uh, you see a uh, an imp with one of its wings broken kind of scurrying away. One of the Red Caps runs after it and boots it over the wall. Uh, <laughs> saying and stay out. Goofy uh, yeah, we'll help scream no. as it goes over the wall. <laughs> um, uh, yeah, uh, Chucker and Clink get off of their their war machine. Um, looks fairly damaged from the battle, so they just kind of leave it leave it parked where it was for now. Um, That's illegal. Yeah. And <laughs> yeah, they're parts on double yellow lines. <laughs> uh, which is bad for our American. I thought this is the lawful evil uh, place. The, the yellow lines being the piss of the imps when they wet themselves <laughs> by seeing the grinder. <laughs> yeah, they've just left the trail side by side. <laughs> you can see there's a lot of blood on the, the sort of output uh things of the uh of the grinder itself. Um yeah, um, so you've got this uh, body of this Abishai, um, I think Sneak stabilised him, the rest of you sort of all gather around it, the unconscious the form of this Abishai. <laughs> there's, 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 um, there's oh yeah, you one, haven't looted anything yet, you're um, still lying there. Yeah. I mean, there's lots of corpses, isn't it? No, yeah, but this is the coolest corpse. one. No. So. Hmm. It'd be disrespectful not to. There's one that's a bit more beefy. No. What, the bone devil? No. He's... No. <laughs> yeah, he you've, already, you've already looted the pogs. <laughs> We're not oh, yeah, talking that's... about the pogs. <laughs> We are talking about. We was given a choice. You mentioned yeah. that a few things we dropped from Magma last session, but you didn't tell us anything about them. 
Uh, yeah, there's a few things that Magma's got if you wanted to. Have yeah, a look. no, that dude must have some. He cool looks stuff. like he's got some cool stuff. He's yeah. edgy. Okay, there's no way cool. he doesn't have some cool stuff. All right, so who's who's having a look at Magma? I mean, I would assume probably think, Magnus and Alan. Yeah, I think we should yeah. go have a look at that. It's only so right. Both of you give me investigation checks, please. Okay, okay. <laughs> the two himbos have to use their intelligence for once. <laughs> <laughs> so what do we see? <laughs> they just turned to the audience like Dora the Explorer, like, <laughs> can you see any loot? Wait, <laughs> say loot if you see loot. Standing on 17 diamonds. <laughs> just like, oh, no. oh my gosh. Okay, check. Investigation. I can spell. That is a right, crisp so... 11. Oh, you're still doing that. Uh, so what did you both get? I got 14. 11. Um, okay, uh, I'd say between you, with your joint effort, mm -hmm. um, mm -hmm. you notice three interesting things. Mm -hmm. No, hang on. One, two. Sorry. Hold on. Can they Five count that much? interesting things. That's a lot of things. Ooh, that is a That's lot of a, things. That is a lot of things. Um, okay, so there is a weird stone that seems Ooh, to have I fallen. Oh, I love weird stones. Yeah, a weird stone that seems to have fallen down next to him. Oh! Uh, his armor also seems pretty interesting. Oh! Uh, his sword looks pretty cool. Oh, hell yeah! Um, his shield... Oh, is also fairly interesting. <laughs> oh, and, uh, and also he's got this weird thing attached to his boots. Oh my god, yes. Need, like, is it a star from a cowboy boot? We need the drum and bass. Yeah, <laughs> it's it's pretty much like a star from a cowboy boots boot. Boots of toe restoration. <laughs> 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 Um, rubbing my grubby little mitts together right yeah. now in excitement. So, <laughs> energy. You can each choose one thing to look at. Okay. Um, and then you we'll go get first. through the rest of it. You said the uh, was it armor? You said the armor. Yes. I love a I love a gander. A goose. Okay. Um. So as, as you kind of undo a bit of his armor and take it off, don't worry. There's underclothes underneath. Um. Yeah, wait. No. They look suspiciously well, there's like nothing, There's nothing underneath because you absorbed him. <laughs> so yeah, there's just nothing. Yeah. Um, it's just the armor. So you pick up the armor and have a look. Um, and you feel a weird presence behind you as you touch this armor. Is it me? No. <laughs> oh, <laughs> being nosy. Uh, so, Alan, you kind of look over your shoulder and you see standing right behind you is Mad Maggie. Oh, God. She's like, oh, that's some interesting army you've got there. <laughs> I love how she just appears. Uh, yeah, I'd like, like, like me to husband. identify it. Sure, I would like to see your identification services, please, madam. Oh, that'll be ten gold per item. I mean, we don't do gold here, never mind. I guess I'll just, <laughs> you'll owe me a favour. Well, I mean, I did pull the splinter out of that, out of your fellow. Oh, yes. that was you, was it? Oh, Oh, I guess that gets you one identification for free. Oh, I'll hand the armor. Oh, oh yes, this this is good. Oh, did did you notice him when you attacked him with any radiant energy? Did you notice him uh, take any less damage from it? I don't know. It was very hard to tell. We were kind of distracted. Uh, you you did. Okay. okay. <laughs> yeah. Yes. Well, Mag Magnus I... probably would have done because you would have attacked him with your. Just horribly dismayed. <laughs> I suppose the radiant thing. My um, magical damage sword isn't doing the magical damage. Yeah. As exactly. Okay. Um. Anyway. Um. Well, she says, "Oh, well, this is armor, plate armor, of uh." Of radiant resistance. It does what it says on the... And she taps the, the metal tin. <laughs> hey. <laughs> oh, thank God there's a description. I like your funny words, magic man. <laughs> right, cool. I will... So if I you guess. wear it, you would be resistant to radiant damage. 
Uh, have we even been attacked by Radiant? I can't oh, wait yeah. for the angels to attack us. Wow. Yeah, <laughs> but that could be quite well, I'll stick it in my virtual pockets. We're getting yeah. all Bayonetta in this. <laughs> <laughs> okay, so that's the armour. Still got the stone, the sword, the shield, and the... Um, okay, so it's, the the, there's stuff attached to his boots, but there's also, mm -hmm. which are part of the armour, um, there's also what looks um, like some sort of reins, Interesting. Uh, which seem to be made out of a similar material to the stuff on the boots. You... I mean, we knew someone with a mount. They should go to Truffles, because Truffles' mount was stolen by Magma. Mm, this is true. <laughs> yeah. um, no. Alright, uh, I heard you guys helped out uh, Barnabas as well. Do you want something else identifying? Uh, they all uh, look very magical. A strange <laughs> stone. <gasps> Please. Oh, yes, that's a good one. That's a good one indeed, yes. Mm. That's an iron stone. Ooh, that sounds cool. Yeah, that's, that's iron, not iron. What does it do? Oh, it's an iron stone of strength. Oh! Mm hmm He was cheating. He was dancing. <laughs> he wasn't actually all that. <laughs> Uh, so, if your strength were, in some weird way, uh, counted in numbers, this would increase it by two. Damn. That is up pretty good. A, up to a maximum of 20. Mysterious. And it also hovers around your head while it does it. That's cool oh, as nice. hell. Wow. Like a, like a small moon orbiting your... Planet sized head. I am the center of the universe after all. Oh, but all mechanics <laughs> exist in D&D. &D. Yes. <laughs> yes, indeed. So I mean, like a moon orbiting a plane of existence. <laughs> uh, right. Well, that's that's the stone. Uh, uh, you you helped me boots? fight off the invaders. That'll get you another one. Hell yeah. Uh, wait, did you say about boots? Oh, there's something on these boots. On yes, boot. I, I could tell you what that is. Yeah, which is... Oh, yeah. Might, I'm going to grab be those reins as well. Fair. We're just like piling okay, up the uh, items now. Yeah. Yes, just, so she uh, <laughs> she takes those and uh, sort of looks at them. Oh, yes, uh, this is something that... I don't know if you know what a Nahatsugon is. A what? They have oh, these... What? Uh, it's what, uh, you remember the vision? It's what, um, Harriman got turned into. Uh, oh, no. what, um, yeah. Hold on, let me get out okay. Devil, let me get out Devil Ted on screen. Devil <laughs> Ted, yes. Yeah. <laughs> uh, he was turned into a Natsugon, it's a form of higher devil. Uh, but they wear these for their mounts, it's called, uh, Infernal Tack. Mm. Mm. So it has a bridle, a bit, reins, a saddle, stirrups, bless it, right? and spurs, although most of those are usually on the nightmare. But can um, be worn by people. Okay, so I'm, I'll just tell you what it does. Um, okay, so a nightmare, which has been equipped with this tack, must serve whoever wears the spurs until the wearer dies or the tack is removed. That's cool. Nightmare. Tack. Unfortunately, the nightmare's dead because you killed it. That's okay. Um, it looks cool. cool. No, that that is propaganda. <laughs> <laughs> it's okay, um, give it so, troubles. <laughs> uh, you can use an action to call the nightmare with the infernal tack. Um, and it can appear from the ethereal plane because it can go into the ethereal plane. So basically, um, you just summon it wherever you want within 20 you feet. Do you remember the name of it? Maybe we can have a pop. Well, the nightmare. Yeah, I don't think we got the name of the of, nightmare. Think of a very you, you don't, name. You don't need to have quick, the name. Yeah. You click the you click oh. the spurs together like Dorothy in the Wizard of Oz, and it appears. Mm. Oh. That is cool uh, as hell. I mean, or, but it does need to be alive. Or, I guess. In in ultimate edginess, um, <laughs> you don't have to. You can either clack them together, or 
you can scrape them through blood. Oh, that's, that's I mean, you've got to find blood for that point. I mean, there's I'll always blood. Some, if... I'll give you some. Magnus is that's... already moving his sword up to his wrist. <laughs> <laughs> oh my god, I love that over. Let's go, no, Magnus. You got beat um, up a lot today. Don't do yeah, it. Anyway, so I'm sorry, uh, I'm sorry, I get your ally away. takes its turn on your initiative count. Um. Mm-hmm. I it's... can't find double dead. It's in here. Uh, so if, if you find if you find something to put it on, you can basically put it on that, and it will be forced to serve you. Ooh. If we put it on a person, it work on people. Yeah, it has <laughs> it has to be something that would be deemed as a mount that you can. I mean, well, <laughs> well, <laughs> Oh yeah, that's what we were going for. <laughs> yes, wasn't truffles technically a mount? <laughs> right. Anyway, that is the infernal tax. So you have the that. Infernal these are all items are also on. on oh, these are all <laughs> items on the Indie Beyond, by the way. If you wanted to mm. put them in your inventory, that sounds cool. Um, you. So far, you've got armor of radiant resistance plate. Okay. Uh, you've got an iron stone of strength, and you've got infernal tack. It's a bit tacky. Oh no! Oh, I like I found it. Him. I, I found like him. tacky. There he is. That's Devil Ted. <laughs> <laughs> okay, uh, so there's the sword and the shield. Yeah, yeah. Oh yeah, the but shield. Yeah. Version. What, what is that? What does the shield look like? Oh, that's a good question. Um, I don't know. I've already had shields with skulls the on them. Shield. That's that's old hat. It's a skull uh, flame shield. <laughs> no. Yeah, we. It can be like one of those. Um... Oh, okay. It's oh. got a falling star on the front oh, of it. Oh, that's no, really it's pretty. Got a falling skunk. <laughs> and, of uh, instead of star. the far, uh, the fire of a falling star, it's just got the little gas smoke <laughs> bubble. <laughs> this is okay. canon now. So... I said it. Yeah, <laughs> can't argue with that. Brian is now the DM. <laughs> yeah. Sure, as, as you see, Mad Maggie looking at it. Um, she kind of looks at Rufus, looks back at the shield, and then doesn't do anything. Sorry. Um, Snake picks up Rufus protectively, just in case Mad Maggie gets any. No, it, it, it's it's like a metal shield, and it's got kind of like a not in, what's the opposite of engraved emboss. It is embossed. Uh, this like is the second time this has come up this week. This oh really? True. Yeah, <laughs> <laughs> um, yeah uh, where it kind of like protrudes outwards rather than being carved inwards. Um, mm. It is this image of the falling star. Uh, so it's not like painted on; it's actually kind of in the metal it's itself. <laughs> <We're> on stream. <laughs> uh, hey, if people can stream in hot tubs, Frank can say that. Yeah, that's true. Oh my. <laughs> Yeah. Oh, I got so many. Did George Takai get in the chat? This stream has a PG rating. <laughs> no, it doesn't. <laughs> anyway, yeah, it's the cool, oh, it's no. cool shield, and uh, she tells you that it is a plus one shield. Ooh. Ooh. With a scum coming. So where where a shield would normally give you plus two AC, this one gives you plus three AC. Ooh, Ooh. that's actually really cool. Ooh. Mm. I really like the shield. Fan- fancy <laughs> magic shield. Okay, and there's also the sword. Which uh, she's also going to. Uh, she's like, "Oh, you brought me back the uh, that war machine. I'll identify that for you as well. I guess you don't owe me anything." Um, it's like she wants to tell us all this stuff. She just yeah. wants to yeah. show off. It is almost like that. <laughs> me, yeah. Yeah. She's, she's, she's a burning all of her spell slots. Yeah. <laughs> like she's a crazy old lady. Uh, she <laughs> just she crow? just knows what these are. Sneaks seduces her. She's she a hag. hag. She's definitely a hag. We already did. She's a famous. hag. Snake undoes a couple of buttons. <laughs> I mean, what? it's nice that Sneak wears clothes, if I'm honest. Always <laughs> polishes her horns up. Very considerate. Right. Um, she kind of Sneak. turns around to you, Sneak, and says, None here. of that! And she just like clicks her fingers and your buttons do up again. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, but um, I hate to like, mention it, but at the end of the last game, Sneak was actually like leaning over the dead Marusa with her head on his. So, like, poor Marusa's getting a nice little booby at the moment. 
<laughs> it's funny That's because like he's extremely he gay. <laughs> like, no, no. I feel absolutely nothing. I am in hell. <laughs> you are my child. Uh, right. Anyway, uh, this sword is a flame tongue long sword. Oh, dude. Oh, dude. Yeah. The Holy Avengers um, game you... thrown away. You can use a bonus action to speak this magic sword's command word. Ooh. Which is, I don't know, flame on or something. Um, uh, yeah, I take that, I take that. Uh, Hold on, guys, and... this is a hint that there's a full fun. It's the Fantastic Four. <laughs> yeah. Yeah. Um, yeah, the other one's made out of rocks. <laughs> <laughs> it, it's cork. <laughs> yes. Um, great. Yeah. Uh, so yeah, the uh, if you speak the word, flames erupt from the blade. They shed bright light in a forty foot radius and dim light for an additional forty foot. While the, the sword, sword is ablaze, it deals an extra two d six fire damage to any target it hits. How oh, does cool. the effect last for? Uh, oops, <laughs> I was doing that as two d eight during the fight. This Never mind. The things the Holy uh, Avenger won't work on. Uh, so yeah, uh, the flames last until you use a bonus action to put them out, or until you drop or sheath the sword. So if you put it in your sheath, the flames just automatically go out. So that you don't burn yourself if you accidentally put it away while it's alight. Um, that's that's it. That's what it does. It does an extra 2d6 fire damage. Uh, otherwise, it is a regular longsword that does 1d8. Fire damage. Ooh. Or 1d10 if you're two-handing yeah. it. Or 1d10 if you're two-handing it, yeah. Um, yeah, so uh, she says, Oh, what, what what are we doing with your friend over there? The one that you didn't kill? Uh, we need to go something. Leaving him. Can I, I cure devil spells? Yes. I don't know. Shove him I mean, in I with can the cure others. curses. No. It's just no. a dead eager on the floor on everyone's him? ignoring. Does it is any does the scars I'm sorry for your cow friend, by the way. Do you know anyone that would be I able to revive our cow friend? Bubble. Okay, so mm, maybe Zariel. No, um, a second do you, shout. Do you have a sending stone <laughs> that could connect us to Zariel? Let's do this. <clears throat> yeah. Power uh, of friendship incoming. Oh no, it <laughs> looks like it's too late for him as you see him kind of like burning away to ash. No, it smells, it smells, it smells ah, amazing. Oh, it does. Oh, yeah. <laughs> <laughs> it smells like a barbecue. Um, um, flame grilled steak. Uh, we are in sync, my love. Yeah. <laughs> um, in sync. Yeah, he kind of, it, it's like. I said it's in like... sync, not in sync. <laughs> yeah. Um, I made anyway, yeah. Just so he just kind of like, as if he were having a Viking funeral, just kind of like <laughs> burns, his body burns away. I could really um, go for a burger right now. <laughs> <laughs> uh, oh, I guess that's part of the contract for all the Alturians. He'll be reforged as a Lemur. And then um, have to fight in Zariel's army. Demon friend. Where would he be reformed? Not a blobby. Or oh, he'll come out of the river sticks people. at some point. Yeah, what the heck? Yeah. Okay. Talk about cheap labour. Isn't it? Hey, I so use... that a no on the <laughs> this is a curse thing? or? <laughs> oh, sorry, yeah. I was dealing with your other friend for now. Um, Man, yes, back to the dragon like, boy. for a contract. Did you try to remove the curse? Is there a curse on him? I, you, you're the ones that said there was a curse. Everything's oh, a curse. Yeah. It's it's hard enough. Remove the curse. It be <laughs> cursed. Uh, it be cursed. I, I can certainly try. Yes. And uh, she leans over Abishai Marusa, and she casts. What uh, I'd say any of the spellcasters in the group would recognize as remove curse. Ooh. Um, nothing seems to happen. No. Do you think that we need to break the infernal contract to free Marusa? Mm, that could work. What is it with all these contracts? I know. Very okay. admin heavy 
I always knew loyals were devils. <laughs> <laughs> when Maruza wakes up, we need to trick Maruza into helping us look for it. <laughs> We're saying it's for Zaria. <laughs> or something like that. Sorry, you said this was Maruza. Who's that? My dad. A friend. Well, let me tell you a story. <laughs> oh, I can oh. see the family resemblance. <laughs> really? You don't have to lie, Maggie. <laughs> she has no, at I least three dads. They, yeah. They've both got horns and... They're both infernal somewhat. Bitch, please, I'm adopted. <laughs> you can look like it's your nice. adopted parents. <laughs> I've gradually developed a resemblance to a dragonborn more than a tiefling. <laughs> Darwin would be proud. <laughs> I, I never knew my parents. That's nice. Oh, man. I knew my parents. It might have been Baba Yaka. Um, God, drama queen. Excuse oh, me. Having normal parents. No, Baba Yaga is, jo is John Wick. I was trying to help us. With her, <laughs> her dad is Keanu Reeves. <laughs> so not parentage. Yeah. Uh, so this is someone you know, is it? Uh, yes. Yes. It's a dragonborn. Well, these things are usually Tiamat servants. No, 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 this is a Bahamut one. Yeah. No, no, it, the, these things definitely serve Tiamat. No, no, they serve Bahamut, the metallic yeah. ones. I think <laughs> he's, that Mad he's not metallic, she's talking he's about. He's chromatic. Well, that's because <laughs> of the devil stuff. <laughs> right, Tiamat is a devil. Tiamat is a devil, not a dragon? She's, she's both. Oh, oh, this is great news. Devil so dragon. the Holy Avenger will work on it. She's mm. the dragon. Right. You, know, you know how Zariel is an angel, but also an archduke that is a devil? No. What? I did not know this. <laughs> Go on. <laughs> right, come on. I've definitely revealed to you, you the have. fact no, that no. Zariel was an angel. <laughs> <Yeah>. <laughs> Don't do this to me. An ex-angel. Yeah. Uh, yeah. Yeah. Well, Tiam had like a god... Of dragons, that's also an arch devil. No. Are you saying that we need to? <laughs> it's just Fran being like, no. <laughs> Are you saying we need to go ask Tiamat? Uh, oh, I, I will write to Tiamat a strongly worded letter, <laughs> and I will hold the Tiamat crown to. <laughs> what well, what I'm saying is it's definitely been forged by Tiamat. If it was I'm gonna... serving Zariel, mm. then it's probably... I, I don't know how it exists. Okay, mm. so we tell him that Tiamat... Wait, if I say Tiamat, wouldn't Marusa turn into flames? Maybe. Wait, what? Well, Marusa was always about Bahamut, but wait, didn't she go against Bahamut once? That's why she had a scar. He had a scar. He did, maybe. Oh, yes, he's still got it. Look. And you oh, yeah. look, and there's still the, the brand. Really? The only thing that's the same? Well, I mean, he's also... I mean, I don't know. Wait, I never knew the guy. I didn't notice that when he was beating the shit out of us. <clears throat> that's I'm gonna I'm scarred. tap Sneak on the shoulder and be like, I'm proud that you want to write a letter. It's good that you finally learned words. I'm so proud of you. Do you remember when she got a magic weapon I mean... from learning words? <laughs> yeah, I know. Words, okay. Yep. I definitely wouldn't be able to read my own letter. So, so what you're saying is this is somebody that you knew that's been turned into an Abishai but doesn't remember their own personality. Seems that kind of remembers mm. that I'm his daughter. Hmm. If only there was somebody with a machine that restores memories. She mm. kind of like puts her hand <laughs> up to her chin. Barnabas has got that machine. She does no, like the got a machine. Where CDI is link, like giggle. <laughs> yeah, fucking them right now. <laughs> what? Please plug them into the machine, the dream machine. Oh, yes, I have one of those. I forgot. Barnabas <laughs> should probably services. use it. 
Wait. Mm -hmm. It was literally less than half an hour ago. <laughs> <laughs> it was. Yeah, but uh, it might have been less than half an hour. Like, it, it was might three be five, weeks ago minutes. in the real world. <laughs> um, right. Uh, oh, I, I suppose I could. If we make a deal. What do you want? Hey. Do you Ooh, want to take you... Smasher from my name? Just literally just bam. I If I can't get Brain back, <laughs> <laughs> I, I really don't brain. care about having Smasher. Mm. No, no, I need something better than a name. What would be good enough? My virginity. No, I already what? Don't lie. Wait, Magnus is a virgin? <laughs> I mean, I mean, the what? Virgin Magnus. No, um. <laughs> Mary no, Magnus, the Virgin Magnus. The the Chad Magnus Chad Allen. is actually the virgin. Oh, <laughs> <laughs> um, darn. Hold on. Let's look, at, let's look at our stuff, guys. Maybe we've got something. What about. Do you know a person called Travick? Uh. No. Well, <laughs> we've got his sand. Oh, yeah, you've got his dust up in you because he turned into dust. This is technically a person that was destroyed by, I believe, some mummy lord. Yeah. Ooh, mummy I've dust. I've also got a broken, steamy crystal. <laughs> broken, steamy crystal. <laughs> it's the oh, one is that, from the bridge? that person tried like to make that. us cross a bridge for some yeah. stupid reason. That was it. All uh, those boats uh, no, sound I good. I'll give you the large rug of helm. What's up there? No, that's no, no, you cannot have that. <laughs> Virginity, fine, not the rug. <laughs> no. Yeah, Ooh, right. that's you rug. can have that's one rug, nice. but not the other. No. Oh, no. <laughs> no. What? What it would go really well are in you, my. Are you a fan of the no. machines? Can't have you it. You a fan of a hole? No, no, I think I want the rug. No, 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 please, no, no. You don't what about have much. <laughs> we don't have much. Just looting a corpse for five magic items. <laughs> <laughs> wait, wait, wait. wait. Five, five good hold magic on, items, hold on, hold on. too. Hear me out. Have you ever thought of going on vacation? Ooh. He could you vacation. Because place. right here, I have a map of Balgor's Gate. Do you mean Baldur's Gate? No. <laughs> no. <laughs> <Big fun> place. <laughs> no, I do not. You see, people outside of it call it Baldur's, but the people there call it the proper name. Oh, I didn't know this. Look, right here, great Starbucks. <laughs> Look, I tell okay. you what, why don't you let me have the carpet? No, no. And no. I'll give you it back. I will just, I'll borrow it. No. Borrow it for what? No. <laughs> no. I'll give you a magic you can't item. Magnus is like hugging, back. he's hugging the carpet right now. <laughs> <laughs> I <laughs> haven't even back taken it out. No. Calm down. <laughs> no. I love that we were literally told Higa's dead hold forever. On, hold on. No emotions. How about this? Carpet. <laughs> this could be very useful. <laughs> What about this that. mask? Uh, I knew we had no, that no. done last year. I still. definitely want the carpet. Oh but my god, this woman. Mask. No. There's nothing special about this carpet. It just looks cool. <laughs> it's Please. special to you, and that means no. it's valuable. <laughs> well, what <laughs> if me. I said I don't care about it then? Give me a wow, position this... check. Sure is it. <laughs> this is such a dumb, unspecial carpet, which I do not care about. And... Just take the mask of murder, okay? Okay. Mag Maggie, yeah. how about the blood Oop. of an Aladrin? That must be a thing that you don't get often. How about the crown of Tiamat? Oh, that You're holding on to that? Oh, no. <laughs> yeah, she's been wearing it. Oh, no, I, I spelled it wrong. I spelled it wrong, but it, it was... No, I, I put perception instead of persuasion. I'm a fool. I'm sorry. <laughs> you perceive that she doesn't believe you. <laughs> She's not going to believe me. This is not going to go well. I don't think don't I'm very. I believe you're extremely charismatic. No, 13. No luck. 
Mm. My belief okay, in the carpet um, is too strong. Yeah. It's the carpet um, or no deal, I'm afraid. Not not fine. my blood. Oh, I'd give you some blood. I, I, I've got plenty of blood, thank you. Oh. Oh, oh. I have the all yeah, good hags wanted you blood. You already have one. Oh, no. <laughs> So I'm handing over the rug? Ooh, yeah, yes, I guess. She's obsessed. She she holds okay. her hands out. Oh. Let me just get it out of my hat. Oh. Uh, no, not you, Sammy. Stay in. <laughs> the distant rattling of bones. <laughs> oh. Snake tries to get in. Hey, look. I may as well get rid of this. And I kind of like throw a quipper to the side. Here you go. <laughs> you still got the fucking. Thing. Oh my god, that is Stop disgusting. That. It really <laughs> smells like as soon as he takes it out of the hat, it's just like this. What is it odor. with your characters and putting fish into like bags of holding and stuff? <laughs> I like fishing. What can I say? Take the vintage rock. fish. Literally, I'm looking through my list of stuff right now, and I'm thinking, why do I have half of this? This rotten quipper to one side, and you just see a bunch of uh, red caps. End on it. Jump on it. And yeah. I just start ripping it to shreds and eating it. Surprised me didn't eat it first, to be honest. You, <laughs> <laughs> you see them all look up at you, Bam, and they just smile at you. <laughs> Do you want some more? I've got some quipper sushi as well. And I throw that away. <laughs> That's not gonna oh, be good anymore. They like they like jump in the air to catch it in midair as you throw it. Ooh. Inventory management. So any other food I can get the rid session. of. Yeah. Yeah. <laughs> 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 I gave you five magic items, now you have to get rid of everything. You, you've been over-encumbered and can no longer run. <laughs> anyway, I passed over the rug, and I got she rid of the fish it, in my hat. And she kind of lays it down on the ground, like really oh dusty God. ground. Ugh, and uh, like, like a corner of it gets in a bit of like devil blood. No! no. I'm giving her the dirtiest side eye right now. She's she's not really looking at you. She's looking at the rug. Yeah, I bet not. Cause um, it's beautiful. Um, That's why. <laughs> beautiful. Oh, yes, I could do something good with this. Mm. And uh, she kind of you see some kind of like Wipes magic her feet on it. Come on. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, she kind of stands on it. Oh. And uh, you see her kind of like wave her hands. <laughs> And it starts to float. Ooh, I mean, that's pretty cool. Yeah. She's going to show us the world. I hope so. <laughs> I can't wait. Oh, <laughs> we're going to have to get You have oh, to sing it as her as well. Yes. She's going to show us the world, all right. <laughs> yes. And, um, the world. Yeah. Yeah. It's <laughs> She kind of like does a lap around you, Magnus and Alum, on this uh, newly flying carpet. I'm really impressed, but I am still upset. <laughs> yeah, she I'm like I'm doing the little potential. the little kid thing. I've got my arms crossed and I'm like, hmm, but I'm also looking because that is really cool. <laughs> I'm trying. I'm trying to not look impressed. <laughs> and she uh, she flies it back over, kind of like over your heads, Magnus and Alan, and lands Rude. it on the ground. And she's like, "Very well, this is a good deal." Uh, puts the unconscious dragon person on here uh, on the car okay mm, yes I drag I hope someone helps me drag I might not I'll be help you. But me not strong thank you we'll, we'll fling it on there yeah no respectfully like just to make it a little bit harder <laughs> what do you mean respectfully no, I have no idea don't. this is this is for <laughs> us <laughs> I put her, put him Isn't on. Company. Yeah, with help. Okay, uh, so you you, you managed to get uh, Abishai Marisa onto the carpet. She's like, right, right, everybody else off. Okay. Snake sits okay. there stubbornly. Right, you can stay. I pick up Snake. Because you're his oh. daughter. No, no, the, the the little green one can stay. Who are you calling little? <laughs> Rude. And come in and get heightest towards you. 
Right, okay, change my mind, get off. Yeah. No, 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 I'm staying with my dad. I continue, yeah, I'm your dad as well, that's why I'm picking you up. Give <laughs> 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 me a strength check. Dad too well, has broken. Holly, if you okay, want to... uh, I would like a strength athletics check from Bam versus your acrobatics or athletics, please, what's Sneak. The, what's this? What's that? That's, that's the item Grapple. that you found. Oh, thank you. So you can just add it to your, your character easy and it'll do everything for you. Oh, yeah, they're, they're all on D&D Beyond if you want to just add mm. them on your... Uh... I don't think I'm winning because Sneak's probably got like a plus 12 and I got a 12. Probably. Uh, and I'm actually good at athletics. D and D be honest with you, slow. I haven't got or decent anyway. Sneak loaded in for some reason. <laughs> Please don't make me use a spell, Sneak. Use one. Right. What did you get, friend? Keeping me in suspense uh, here. Twenty-two. <laughs> Yeah, she slips out of your grasp. You can How? you can let this one stay, it's fine. As long as she doesn't you cause any more me. trouble. <laughs> right. Sneak resumes sitting on Rosa. Pokes her tongue up, out. But away her. and uh, the carpet just starts to lift off the ground. Uh, with you and <laughs> you and Abishai Bruiser <laughs> on it. <laughs> <laughs> and she starts uh she starts kind of like floating it over towards where the dream machine was. Uh she does it like a a fast walking pace if the rest of you want to keep up on the ground. Wow, like she's only hovering a couple of feet off the ground. It's not like <laughs> she's flying with it. While we're walking, I wish to check if there's signal. <laughs> <laughs> no bars. Oh, what, on your sending? Yes. Who are you trying to contact? Leoson. Um, yeah, uh, you... Actually, I should probably wait until we see if it succeeds. Okay, fair enough. Um, Save my data. (laughs) (laughs) Okay, so you're not doing anything. Is expensive and how? No, no, no. Okay. Uh, okay. So you eventually Probably get your go. way. Get you eventually make pipes you... up. Uh, you eventually make your way back to uh, the chamber where uh, where you left Truffles to recover. Hello. She seems to be just waking up now. She okay? seems a bit groggy still. Hello. She oh. heard a lot of fighting. There's a fight she's going on. We're a man down, Truffles. What? Yeah. Oh no! Oh, oh it's not here! Oh, oh. Mm. Cow man. Oh, that's okay. Truffles don't like you. <laughs> oh, Truffles! <laughs> Tr- Truffles the savage. <laughs> no! Um, there's only one right, anyway. animal allowed in this party. <laughs> 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 the um, slut of a nine talker animal was already taken. <laughs> little, little one, please fly over there for a second. We need oh. to use this cushion. Okay. And Truffles is still just lying in the cushion in the middle of the machine. <laughs> I've warmed it up for you. <laughs> oh, yes, it's very nice and warm. I'm sure this unconscious thing will appreciate it. Uh, and she kind of lands the carpet next to where the cushion is. And, uh, oh, you, green one, help me. And uh, just kind of like starts to lift uh, Abishai Marusa off of the carpet to put him onto the cushion. Struggles. She has a minus one to strength. Yeah, you. you you struggle, but you do manage to move him. Uh, also, someone picked up his sword to carry it as well, because he probably would have dropped that as he went unconscious. I don't mind being on sword duty. Oh my god, you're just collecting swords, aren't you? I just really oh, like swords. Did anyone swords. pick up Higa's sword? 
Or, or, or I mean, I would have. I was trying to tell you to loot Higa's body, but no one did it. <laughs> well, I didn't know that was an option. Can we go and loot Higa's body? <laughs> we'll, we'll sort Higa's stuff out. No, I mean, it was pretty much just the sword, wasn't it? That was like no. notable. But... Flowers. He had a couple more things that were interesting. Okay, we'll we'll sort that out between sessions, I think. No, let's do it now. Um, there you go. Dreadhelm and a pot of awakening. Oh yeah. There you go. And some plate armor. Can I take some flowers? And his great axe. Oh. Uh, and his flower crown. Oh. Okay. <laughs> <laughs> oh no. Uh, do you I want to put the list the in, uh, in, in game season. info and then people can decide what they want of it? Yep. Okay, uh, so she puts Abishai Marisa down with the help of Sneak in the cushion. Uh, you remember how we did this before, right? Yes. Cool, could you tell me? Because I've forgotten. <laughs> um, I've dropped fast. Okay, I was lying. Truff, truff, pass! <laughs> truff, truff, pass. Pass the truff. Truff, magic dragon. So, you don't remember? No. Can we have our rug back then? Grab our ball back, please. <laughs> I think he's dropped out. <laughs> ah, we oh, no. <laughs> ah, we get our carpet back. There we go, on my back. Damn yeah. it. Okay. So you honestly don't remember? Oh no, we, we like joined hands and then we dance you know, like pretty boys. Do memory dives. It's pretty cool. Anyway, we should do that. Everybody gather round. Oh, do we get to hold hands? Not you, Truffles. You don't need to. Uh, the holding hands is optional. Well, uh, you hold hands at the... Hold my hand. Yeah, you can see that like the 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 cushions around the central one are all sort of uh, equally spaced, so you would be able to hold hands around it. Can I hold Maggie's hand? Oh, <laughs> yes, please. Oh, you're a young strapping lad person. <laughs> wow. <laughs> it's okay. That's in character. Old people misgender folks all the time. <laughs> That's true. <laughs> Fine, I will still hold Maggie's hand. Okay. What does a what does a hand feel like? Yeah, that's a good question. Feels like I hope it's surprisingly smooth. Yeah. It's, it's kind of moist. Oh, um, oh no. Yeah. But, moist Maggie. But also like dry and wrinkly at the same time somehow. <laughs> so she's a sweaty man. And her nails are too long. <laughs> oh like they haven't been manicured in a while. Um, uh, it's, it's, she she, she's got nice warm hands. hands, though. Uh, you know they feel almost comforting. It's almost good. Oh, who's gonna hold my other one? I'll hold your other hand. There's all the figure stuff. Well, anything is good. Okay. Uh, okay. So we got we got Ephraim, then Maggie, then Magnus. So who's going to hold Magnus's hand? Nice to feel some positive human contact. Me. Mm. Okay, so Ephraim, Maggie, Magnus, Alum. Who's going after Alum? Uh, is, is there only two people left? I'll go next. Yeah. Okay, so then bam, and then sneak, you hold Ephraim's other hand. In character. Yeah. Sneak, okay, so you're, you're going to all... get through this. We believe in you. What happened? What's happening? I just want my dirt back. You you just rest, Truffles. You're still tired. Oh. Truffles, come and lean up against me. Okay. Truffles, we're transferring player bases. You don't have to hold hands. What? <laughs> what does that mean? It's a wizard thing. <laughs> I'm scared. Okay. <laughs> okay. Maybe so you we all, did not have uh... to do the after story. <laughs> <laughs> you can't fire me! I'll fire me! I can't! 
<laughs> okay. <laughs> well, after what Truffles just said about Higa, who? <laughs> um, it's because look. The truffles is cancelled. Truffles put that on <laughs> and it was uncovered. <laughs> Gaslight gatekeep trough boss. <laughs> <laughs> right, anyway. Um, yeah. Uh, she's like, all right, I'll, I'll begin in a minute. My TND Beyond sheet looks so empty now that I have two less characters this week. <laughs> <laughs> yeah. Oh, what did you delete them? Well, I had to make space for new ones. Oh, it's only like two quid on D and D Beyond to have unlimited character slots. Is it? Oh, yeah. Well, yeah. I didn't well, know it. Is that a permanent us. unlock? Uh, it's well, it's like a monthly yeah. charge. It's yeah. like a subscription. Oh. Yeah. Oh. oh, that's a bit shy. Oh. Why would they use their money for D and D Beyond when they could uh, pay to sub to us? I don't get it. <laughs> None of this makes sense. <laughs> Please note the owner of this channel does not. Uh, Andy does not speak for, for for the owner of this channel. <laughs> not yet. Not yet. Spend your money on it on whatever you like. It's my but if you're watching us, that means you like us. Happen. So. No, uh, Ellie, you ready to do this? Everyone. Yeah, yeah, I'm up for it. Okay, cool. Yeah, we're just dreaming right now. Yeah. Yeah. Um, so similar to before, you kind of lose your grip on reality Ooh. as your vision fades into a familiar now uh, experience of dipping into uh, the dreamlike visions. Um, but then all of a sudden, you kind of your uh, your vision returns to the room that you're in. Um, sneak. You find yourself looking at yourself. Uh, so, Ephraim. Am I really that ugly? You're looking at yourself, Alan. Oh, I'm you're looking at, at yourself, but with zero depth perception. <laughs> Wait, what? <laughs> what do you mean, looking at myself? I'm scared. Yeah. I'm scared. Um, and uh, yeah, so <laughs> yeah, from you're looking directly across the circle at yourself from where Alan was, mm. you feel a strange oh, no, sensation in your was. toe. Uh, uh, yeah, sneak. Um, you've got a weird amount of swords on your person currently. Uh, <clears throat> Magnus, so... you you touch your head and you've got some horns. And... Hell yeah! In murderous intent as well. <laughs> and uh, Alan, you're very seasonal currently. Uh, <laughs> oh. No. Uh, <laughs> Bab. No, you're looking across the circle as no. your yes, bam! I'm your hands feel that. a lot moister. <laughs> you're not stopping that because you don't have that currently. <laughs> walk over there. <laughs> you see, you see, bam, and he's just like, "Oh, sorry, uh, this happens sometimes." Uh, everyone, sit back down again. <laughs> hold on, hold Are on, you? hold on. No, hold on. No. What's the hag spell list? <laughs> I want to pray to Helm. Oh, oh like, I can Helm, tell you this. There? Give me a second. <laughs> no. Helm. 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 Oh. Are you here? The Wait, Hag spell list. Okay, you have to? got. You have oh, got wow. detect magic, magic mm -hmm. missile, plane shift, ray of enfeeblement, and sleep. Wait, that's it. Did you say plane shift? Yes. Oh, we can get out of Avernus. Yourself only. Oh. That's fine. <laughs> <laughs> you think I get? He's just like, I'm out. <laughs> <laughs> the campaign is now Mad Maggie on tour. What are you going to do? <laughs> can you You're imagine the Benadorm? revenge I can get on Blossom if <laughs> Mad Maggie appears? Turns up as Mad Maggie. <laughs> <laughs> okay. 
Anyway, please continue. We're sitting down. <laughs> yeah, she's like, uh, one second, I'll I'll fix this. <laughs> <laughs> It just yeah, sounds you kind like of, you... when you're doing Bam's voice, you're biting the inside of your lip. <laughs> uh, I mean, I'm not. Oh, but... you've heard this voice before, have you, Frank? <laughs> <laughs> A few times, it's his bedroom voice. <laughs> yes, I like to it's like... It's like Bam. It's like fucking Miles in, in the spider Man. Hey. hey. <laughs> King of the Red Lions. Hey. Hey. <laughs> <laughs> anyway, um, you, you dip back into the vision, and uh, you, you come back out in a unfamiliar place. Um, you see what looks like a young Maruza. Please don't be Leoson's bedroom. <laughs> like the actual Maruza. Both eyes. Bo- yeah, both eyes. Oh my God. Ah. Uh, um. Do you want to take over from here, Ellie? Uh, yeah, so Mar- Marusa would be sort of, you know, um, at a desk, um, studying feverishly. Feverishly. What's that? Uh, right, yeah, studying feverishly, writing down stuff, dipping his quill in some ink. Um, stuff. There is another person in the room. Um, they appear to be elvish in nature. Um, and they're just sort of watching over him. Um, yeah, if you want to. Yep, um, sure. Uh, so after this sort of studying vision completes, you uh, dip back out. Um, Thanks, vision Dad. fades again and uh, <laughs> uh, goes back into a similar looking stonework to the same building you were in before. Um, seems like this is the place the Marusa studied when he was younger as a monk. Um, and you see a halfling, would that be right, yeah, Ellie? Yeah, he's a halfling, yeah. Yeah, um, you see Marusa just like walking through the halls with this halfling. Um, uh, no, no, be, be careful. You shouldn't be on your feet just yet, but uh, you, you've healed rather rapidly, and I... I, I um... I would like for you to um, try at least. Mm, yes, uh, this this bandage you gave me—it's rather rather stylish. Uh, you you took it off the 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 merchant cart on when when you were healing me, did you not? Mm. Uh, should should we give it back? And you see a familiar bandana, which is like wrapped around this halfling's arm. Hmm, no, you keep it. I, I, I can pay the, the merchant for it. Uh, just, just as long as you're all right. If you like it, you can have it. Okay, well, it is. I think it's healed up enough now. Uh, and he, he kind of takes it off his arm. You can see there's like a sort of scabbed over wound there. Um, and he sort of uh, ties it around his head. He's like, I'll, I'll, I'll get it cleaned. But, uh, <laughs> yeah, I, I like it. Thank you. Hmm. It's my pleasure. Mm, thank you for your help. Mm-hmm. Would have died if you weren't there to help me. Mm. It is this sort of resolution that makes me very proud to be a doctor. Perhaps I will uh, stay here and study. I, I'd like to help people as you do. Mm. Well, um, you are more than welcome to do so. Um, oh, that was a eager voice. <laughs> Um, <laughs> you're more than welcome to do so, my friend. Um, just do please take it easy. You have sustained a lot of damage. Yes, yes, I, I, I will. And uh, the vision kind of fades again. Um, how did you want to do the next one, Ellie? Sort of. Um, do the the. Yeah. Leas in one? Sure. Okay, um... <laughs> no. So you see... <laughs> <laughs> Did they have cute nicknames um, for each other? Oh, that's how Marusa lost his eye. Pineapple! <laughs> 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 Pineapple! 
Um, no, she's a, 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 a Marusa who, um, do you, I don't think he'd have lost his eye by this no, point. No, not yet, he? not yet. No. Um, so you see him talking with this half-elven, uh, fellow monk that you recognize as Leo Sin Elantar. Um. Before it was Leo Sin Vulcan. Yeah, boy. Hey. Uh, oh yeah, that would be a thing, wouldn't it? Yeah. <laughs> um, it's just like I, I, I've studied here long enough, Marusa. Please tell me we see the vision of them getting married. <laughs> I, I must join the Harpers. It's a great cause. My yeah. skills will be better put to use. Use I don't want What's you. To leave. I don't want you to leave oh, me. Right. Um. Well, Please just come with me. Stay one more day. Uh, you can go then. On a, like, just no, no. Or who said, "Come, come with me." I can't. Leo said, "My my people are here. This is this is where I can help. This is where I belong." Well, you you know where to find me. <sighs> I mean, we work in secret, and you probably won't be able to find me, but. Like, I'll, I'll, I'll leave clues that only you would know. Very well. But please just stay with me a little bit longer. I'll stay one more night, and then I must go. Thank you. Okay, and they walk. Uh, they walk off hand in hand. Oh. And we fast forward. To Leosin sat at a desk. He looks a little bit older. He's got some grey in his hair now. Um, as he is half elven, not full elven. Um, he seems to be writing sort of a a secretive letter. Uh, he writes it in this weird looking ink. It's not quite fully black, and then he burns it over a candle, and the ink disappears. But the letter remains, um, and he's he's sat in like this this inn room. You don't recognise the inn, and you hear a knocking on the door. He's like, "Come, come in," and he you see him like get one of his daggers out, and uh, through the door comes Marusa, now missing an eye. I finally found you, but Marusa. Yes. What what happened? Hey. And well, then he's wearing the bandana now as well, I would think, right? Yeah, he'd be wearing it around his horn yeah. one of his horns. Yeah. I like the, the missing eye seems fairly fresh. I don't want to speak about it right now. I would uh, Okay, it's... come come sit down. And uh you see Leosin kind of lead Marusa over to the uh the bed in the room. They both sit down side by side on it. They sort of just, Marusa's like staring off, sort of like into the distance. Like he's clearly talking to Leosin, but he's just like, yeah, traumatized. I Here, guess. Let me uh, just don't 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 say anything, Marusa. Let me uh, <laughs> and uh, Leosin kind of pulls some uh, like a medicine kit out of his pouch, starts cleaning up the uh, the eye wound. Marusa kind of hisses as the, the yes. alcohol touches uh, the uh, this is one, wound. This is one moment I wish I hadn't taught you so bloody well. <laughs> Look, I'm, I'm sure you'll tell me about it soon, but Marusa, now, now we're together again. Just don't... <sighs> Look, I, le I leave you and look what happens. Let's yes. never Lewis leave each other again. Bye, no. They yeah. vampires. I, I think vampires everywhere. everywhere. Thousands of them. Well, what, what? What about the monastery? The students uh, were turned. All of them. Oh. That's... I, was... I ran, Leosin. I left them. 
What about Tumble? Tumble took my eye. Tumble did this? He did. I was lucky to escape. He had such infernal strength. I... I didn't know what to do, Leosin. I just ran. Well, you're, you're here now. You're safe, Marusa. I couldn't save them. Just get get some rest. You're obviously exhausted. We'll we'll deal with whatever this is in the morning. And you see him kind of put Marusa in the bed, put the sheets over him. He's exhausted. And he, he kind of go. He, he falls asleep straight. Yeah, Mar oh. yeah Marusa drifts off almost immediately. Leosin stands over him for a moment before going back to the desk and sitting there watching Marusa sleeping before finally he starts to cry. As we move on from that vision. We love an edgy backstory, everyone. <laughs> it's <just> sad. <laughs> um, we move on to a happier memory as you see Marusa and Leosin again in a uh, sort of multi-faith chapel, I suppose you would call oh, it. Oh, no! <laughs> Both in smart monk no, clothes so of their cute. order, holding hands, looking at each other. Um, do you want to play this one out, Ellie? Yeah, sure. Um... No, as in, do you, you want to say what happens here? I, I mean, it's your oh, character, so... So, sure. Um... There's not many people in attendance. Um, it's quite a quiet wedding. Um, the only people really there are like Ontar and like the other Harpers, I guess. Um, Bruce is probably wearing like yeah. a, a a very fresh looking Harper pendant. Um, there's uh sort of like on the pews there yeah so like on Tars there who who else have we met from the Harpers I can't really remember uh I don't think you've really met any uh well any there's a couple Harpers. of people you don't recognise then um yeah um uh, Higa would be there probably yeah Higa there's a there's a, there's a cowman at the back sort of looking a little bit um confused maybe maybe even a little <laughs> bored um. <laughs> He's, but he's like on his own at the back. He's kind of like just staring, and there's a. He looks kind of proud, but mostly for Leo Zen. He he doesn't really like Marusa at all. <laughs> but uh, you, you see a few. Um, oh, actually, you know what? Screw it. I, I'd say Bjorn would be there as well. Oh, that's interesting. With both his arms. Yeah, there's a there's a werebear sort of lad there. He's he's very. Um, uh, he seems to be oh, there God. with Higa. Yeah, he's, <laughs> he's with Higa. <laughs> what a lad. <laughs> look at this Look at this council of dads we've assembled. Um, <laughs> the council of dads. <laughs> Spelt C-O-W-N-C-I-L. <laughs> <laughs> um, and he's just like... Uh, losing... After you left the monastery, um, it was one of the most um, difficult times of my life, but I'm glad you did, because... And he looks down, a... sad. It was difficult for me as well, but now we'll, we'll never be apart again. Yes. And he kind of lifts Marusa's head up to look him in the eye. Never again. Yeah. Smash cut. Uh, it cuts out just as they're about to kiss. Yeah. Yeah. <laughs> no. They're just about to kiss and then it fades. Still a better no. wedding than Mr. Ratburn. No. <laughs> huh? Still a better wedding than Mr. Ratburn on, on Arthur. Yeah. <laughs> uh. <laughs> <laughs> And then it zooms back in and you see them snogging and yeah. then it fades oh, back out. No. <laughs> <laughs> uh, 
Um, so yeah, it goes, uh, cuts to another scene with Ooh. Marusa. Plot twist, Leon had a baby in his arms. No. <laughs> <laughs> That's too much. No, no, no. <laughs> Bjorn had a small tiefling. Yeah, a little tiny. No, no. <laughs> little, little kid's tiefling. Um, <laughs> looking really bored and chasing after a rat. <laughs> Um, oh, she was terrified. <laughs> yeah. Uh, yeah, before. Uh, yeah, so we see uh, Leeson and Marusa again. Uh, Leeson saying, Look, I have to go to uh, Greenest. There's something there that concerns the leaders of the Harpers. Something about a cult. Is the cult dangerous? You... It's potentially the world ending kind, if what they say about them is true. Then they would need my expertise and help as well. I'm coming with you. Right. You you finish up your mission here and my... I'll see you in Greenest in a few days. I will join you as soon as I'm able, my love. Goodbye, Marusa. I'll see you soon. Goodbye, Lucy. Let's not stay apart for long. Never apart again. And gives like Never a slight again. snide smile. Yeah. And then Altera uh, blew up. <laughs> and then Altera <laughs> blew up. <laughs> <laughs> this would be before uh, this would be just before Leeson got captured. Yeah, yeah. Uh, yeah, and you raided the camp to, to get him back. Um, so Marusa would have turned up like... That's me. <laughs> yeah, there's Bam. <laughs> uh, and we don't know who those people are. <laughs> <laughs> we go, uh, we go quite far forward now. Um, to uh, a place that you all recognise as Helm's Shield Hall, where you fought Magma the first time. Uh, but this is uh, this is focused on. Bam, Sneak, and Marusa, who were fighting the the ghostly apparitions. Uh, you see Bam fall to the floor. Uh, Bam, you feel how you felt then again in this vision. You feel like the life draining away from you as uh, Marusa is also lying unconscious on the floor. Wait, was that how it played out? No, I think you went down after Bam, didn't you? Yeah, Marusa went down after Bam. So I think I think what would have happened was like Bam went down, Marusa heard yeah. it, turned around, and then got smacked himself. That was it. Yeah, that was it. Wait, yeah. Didn't, so wasn't you down? I threw a holy hand grenade, and then something happened. That's n no, I think you were down way before Marusa was. On the way, turn into Marusa. Hmm. You were down I like thought two. you was down first, then I died. I, I think I you were beating up a barbed devil around the corner, and then you came back round as yeah. you saw Bam go down, and then you got down. That's what I think happened as well. Yeah, and it, yeah, I'd, I'd have to go rewatch it, but that was. Let's say this. Anyway, is the new it, canon. Ends, it ends up with both <laughs> of them down. Yeah, this is the new canon. Um, and you see uh, Marusa as we played out before, uh, rising in front of Bahamut himself. Uh, their voices are kind of muffled as Marusa spoke to his god. Yeah. You see the hellish form of Zariel appear Yo. in the air between them both. What are you doing here? These ones, man. No. No! Grab oh, shit, Marusa by see. the neck. Uh, and drags him down and down ah! further, further away from Bahamut. Maruza's is struggling. Zariel just punches him in the face. Um, Don't remember that bit. <laughs> no, no, this the we we cut away before this bit. This is this is the Gandalf going after the Balrog bit. Uh, Extended. You just saw you just saw him fall down. This is the bit afterwards. <laughs> um, so yeah, uh, you see Zariel dragging Maruza down and down through the material plane, smashes into the ground. Um, Going not as far as you expect into the ground, but then emerges in the sky of Avernus, 
like a falling star falling from the sky smashes into the ground in Avernus into the, the reddish dust it keeps going smashes through the various layers of hell you see a cold wintry place a place with forges melting coins and various other layers of hell uh, before uh, Maruza getting knocked more and more unconscious as each layer is smashed through as finally they land on the very bottom layer of hell Zariel drags the unconscious form of Maruza Maruza's soul we should say uh, over to what you recognize as Asmodeus I have something special planned for this one. I need your permission to do it. And uh, you cut away to a tower uh, near a huge dragon-like skull. On top of this tower, there's two figures fighting. One is Zariel. The other is a red dragonborn. Except this one's got a tail. Um, Half dragon? Nope. Uh, it doesn't look quite like Cyan Wrath. It looks more dragonborn like. Uh, they have sort of different facial features. So half dragons kind of have heads that look like the like, dragons like that they are heads. half of. Yeah, anyway, you, you can tell it's a dragonborn rather than a half yeah. dragon because you've seen some half dragons in your time. Um. But this one has a strangely glowing green hand. And it rides a uh, a dragon, or it was riding a dragon. The dragon now lies dead on top of this tower as this dragonborn dismounts it. Zariel flies down, not giving an inch of reprieve to this character she's fighting. Uh, pummels him into the ground. He holds up the hands, uh, pushes her back with a wave of force. She looks down at him and says, Arkan, you cannot beat me. Just do as I say. Reforge the soul. She kind of points behind her. And you see this sort of... Uh, uh, do you know what a lemure looks like? The blob of flesh and horribleness. Blobby. Yeah, horrible yeah. blobby. Yeah, Mr. Blobby. Because um, <laughs> all souls that emerge from the River Sticks are born as these uh, very bottom rung of devils. Um, he says, this is someone who served Bahamut. I wish to reforge his soul. In the forge of Tiamat as an Abishai. It is fitting for him. And he will serve me. And the aesthetic is kind of on point. Ah, uh, yes. <laughs> um, <laughs> and uh, Arkan kind of looks up at her. Tiamat will not be happy. You can deal with her wrath kind of clutches this vial of blood that he has on his neck. And uh, it kind of glows for a second and he disappears through a portal behind him. Uh, as uh, Zariel drags this little Mr. Blobby uh, <laughs> ruining the dramatic moment. <laughs> from <laughs> Uh, <laughs> kind of just picks it up and chucks it in this uh, this vat of basically lava stands there for a few seconds and then emerges the form of the newly reforged Maruza who emerges as a black Abishai uh, and you all fade back out of the visions back into reality as uh, awaking in the center is still in Abishai form 
uh, Marusa Volcom. Mm -hmm. What? Oh, my head. Snake runs over. Oh, no. <laughs> oh, something's gone very wrong. <laughs> Bam's realizing he really doesn't want to die. Ah! <laughs> uh, why? Hello. <laughs> Just let me die! <laughs> <laughs> no. No, not yet. Please! <laughs> God damn! We're trying to beat a wreck. Which? What was that? We're trying to beat a record here. <laughs> how many times can we bring a character? For how much damn you both? <laughs> Just let me die! Can we swap you out for the cow man? <laughs> I'm joking, I'm joking. What? <laughs> what cow man? Oh, well, there was oh, a cow yeah. man, and he was really cool. Seriously? But we lost oh, him, he died. You're saying you don't, don't have well. a cow man? <laughs> <laughs> oh, yeah. Uh, so it's cool. We made yeah, maybe, maybe don't look downstairs. It's a bit of a yeah. train wreck. Uh, yeah. You know, bodies, you oh, know, and just, uh, stuff hold, happens. And, yeah, you know, hold off on the burger jokes for a bit. <laughs> I'm honestly surprised. Yeah. It, how long has it been? I don't think you'll be having kids anytime soon. It's been like no. a few days. Oh, yeah. God, that feels like an eternity. Ugh. Um, Probably yeah, was. you see, uh, Marusi, you see this hag looking over at you. Hello, dearie, I see oh, you're awake shit. again. <laughs> <laughs> sorry, That's sorry. What I thought. Sorry, you took my You don't look very good yourself, dearie. Uh, fuck. Um, uh. right. She holds up a mirror in front of you. <laughs> oh, my God. Sorry, I need to stop shouting. Um... <laughs> oh, Bahamut. Oh, but, uh, <laughs> uh, fuck Bahamut. I've missed that voice. I remember exactly what Bahamut did. Um, yes, this is quite startling, but I've never really been I much know what of Bahamut a. Bahamut did. I've never been much of a, a looker, so. Not true. I've never given a devil its memories back before. This is new. I didn't know I could do this. Uh, do you think you could do this to literally everyone in El Torel? Uh, if we found the devil forms, perhaps. Okay. Side quest unlocked. Ma'am. <laughs> Where is Leo? Collect is all he safe? 10,000 members of Elter. Oh, I can actually check that. I can actually uh, do that now. Hold on. Let me just try and find a signal. <laughs> Leo said, we found him again. <laughs> what? <laughs> <laughs> God, there's uh, always I one that's sending. Lewison, we found Marusa again. <laughs> uh, yeah, Marusa's had a makeover, different color. Uh, but <laughs> remember stuff again. We got uh, got him back. You can respond to this. Yeah, uh, you just a few seconds pass, and you hear a boop boop. <laughs> I've got like a Wi-Fi marking on my arm. I've just got it to my head. <laughs> yeah. That's not funny, Bam. <laughs> no, he's dead. Oh God damn it! Hold on. Can the sending spell send pictures? I don't think so. <laughs> just, just, just like yes. click. Just like blink, and it just goes. Ch -ch. <laughs> <laughs> no, that's a different item. God yeah. damn it. Hold on, I've got another third level spell yeah. slot. I can do it again. No, um, not in here, Trouble. He... He... <laughs> not in here, Trouble. <laughs> Go outside and do it. Yeah. Um, no, you you hear... Uh, <laughs> you hear Leoson's voice as he finishes his message. If it is true, he is back. Tell him to come back to me once this is finished. Finish your quest, and then return to me. Okay, That's there it. was an important bit Beep. missing there. Oh, tell him I love him. <laughs> uh, you didn't hear that bit, but I'm good. <laughs> Marusa, Leosun said, yes. if it is true that you're alive, because he doesn't believe me for some reason. Am I alive? 
Honestly, I thought I was pulling back in I don't know. That's a good question, actually. We're not sure if you yeah. are. Yeah. But are yeah. any of us really alive? My hands feel no, odd. No, don't, be, don't be doing that, Maggie. My hands feel really <laughs> fucking weird right now. Anyway, he said, finish your mission, which I guess is our mission, uh, and then come back to him alive, and he said he loved you. Ew. Yeah. Um, well, this complicates things. I kind of just want to go back to him, and, and I don't really want to. I don't think we Do could beat Ariel. Re- you know that message? I honestly don't think we could beat Ariel. <laughs> Why not? But we're gonna convince her to be a good girl, dude. She, she's really strong. <laughs> The power of friendship. She, she beat me through nine hells and the material. She plane. literally threw me through three different, uh, nine different planes, maybe ten. 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 Oh, ten. Okay. ten. Yeah. Yeah, but have you seen the war machine we got outside? The. I'm sorry. What? <laughs> yeah, but I beg your uh, fucking pardon. It shreds through bears. You, you would have seen the one outside Helm Shield. Why, or, why do you? Why do you measure it shredding power by bear? Oh no, you didn't. <laughs> We didn't. What the fuck is going on? Where are we? <laughs> oh, this is for Mad Max. <laughs> thank, <laughs> thank, thank you. Um, the, the, the best mechanic shop in all of Avernus. <laughs> he just sort of like side eyes. Like, bam, like, why are we <laughs> here? Doesn't he always side eye? <laughs> yeah, I guess. He's like, <laughs> <laughs> no. It's worse now because... Because of how um, Avishai's the faces heads. look. Yeah, yeah, they're kind of like eyes on either side, aren't they? Rather yeah, than they've facing. got big prey eyes rather than... Yeah, oh, no. okay. <laughs> so Let what's up to the Avishai? Mm. <laughs> so, once, after you died, we did some other things, and it eventually led to us having to leave El Torel. We came down here, we found two Kenkus. One sounded a little bit like you, but the voice was off. And the other one was another Kenku. <laughs> Clink just appears around the corner. Hello. Then we had a Mad Max race where we eventually ran into a person called Mad Maggie. That's her. Oh, Hi. You have she my thanks. at you. Uh, we learned about Truffle's past. Apparently it relates to Zeriel. I'm shocked too. Shock Truffle's face in the corner. <laughs> Uh, and then, literally, I think half an hour later, we did the same to you because you attacked us. Oh, I'm sorry, I didn't hurt anyone, did I? No, it was not. Uh, no, it was just me and them. It was not myself. Well, I don't remember that bit. I was unconscious for most of it. Why we? You... Oh, Bam, I'm... I'm sorry. Truly, I oh, don't worry. did not have my own autonomy. This is... I mean, I'm not dead. I was going to say no one got hurt for Taja. Uh, you, you would remember the battle. I, uh... Did you try to trap me in a stone wall? No. That was very smart. Good job. Uh, give yes. me a. Uh, let's just call it a history check Ooh. from Marisa. Ooh. I remember. It's a new spell I learned lately. It felt very Goliath y. Uh, that's oh. a 15. Uh, you remember Higa being present in the battle? Wait a second. The bloody Minotaur was there. Where is he now? Is McDonald's? That- McDonald's. <laughs> wow. <laughs> wow. That's so mean. Yes. Sorry, I, in I said Mad Maggie wrong. Infernal McDonald's. <laughs> no, seriously. McMaggie's. Where, seriously, where's he at? The heart. He, he died. He's a heart. No, he didn't. That he motherfucker's died. a hardy bastard. Trust me, I've I've fought him a million times. He always he, fucking wins. He, he he's dead. Oh. He had a Viking funeral, whatever a Viking maybe. Yo, yo, <laughs> yo guys, we're kind of fucked. <laughs> <laughs> it's 
that shit kills Hugo. Like, oh my god. <laughs> We're fucked. <laughs> I mean, the person who killed Hugo is now dead. Who is that? Magma. Who the fuck is Magma? <laughs> You never met Magma, did you? You were like, no, no. We were dealing with the sneak were, situation when that was going. You on. were like a hundred foot away, but you never saw him. Actually, that was the first time I saw him as well. Yep. Is he dead? Oh, yes. Um, uh, he's part of those two, and I'll gesture to Magma well, out. Let me show you what he looks like, <laughs> and I point at the other two. Right. But I thought they were twins. Point to sneak. They can't be a bird <laughs> twin. That's not how it works. They're, they're, well, they're triplets. Oh. All right, then. Hmm. Well, as long as he's... Are you are you two okay? No. Um, Magnus, Alan. Mostly. Was that... Yeah. Um, we're a bit embarrassed. Was, was that traumatizing for you, killing your own... Well, I mean, not really, because he was a bit of a tool. I felt probably Sorry. more killing that than kicking you in the nets. You did oh what? My gosh, I'm sorry. Yeah. I'm, I'm sorry. Oh. oh, I'm surprised you haven't noticed. And the pain just hits him. <laughs> the pain just hits him. <laughs> <laughs> Absolute fruitcake down. You're going to save a lot of money on contraception. <laughs> they're, they're still... They're still inside him currently. He just buckles. <laughs> he, he just buckles down onto Ow. his knees. <gasps> <laughs> you know, if you employ that tactic among most other Absarian's army, I'm pretty sure we could kill her. Mm. <laughs> <laughs> Kick Zariel in the nuts. <laughs> oh, definitely. She's got bigger balls than the Tom's finest. You're looking at him. What about? <sighs> hold on. What, what about you, Nick? Have, have you, uh, daughter? Have you been well behaved? Sneak. Tell, uh, tell yes. Arisa about your learning to spell. I can read can some grab. words now, and it got me a magical bow. <laughs> he just like looks at everyone, just like. <laughs> Did you do that? <laughs> like, <laughs> I, I, I help teach her. She just needed civilizing. Mm. He's the best babysitter. Snake is behind Rosa slightly shoveling a handful of grubs into her mouth. You have run out of grubs <laughs> ages ago, girl. Like, yeah, you, do, you don't have any grubs left. <laughs> There's still work to be done. You even, not only did you go through your grubs, you went through the ones I had for fishing. That's how many grubs <laughs> you've used. You also went through Rufus's grubs. Oh, yeah, Rufus I, is I starving think... in there. Speak <laughs> yeah. would share the uh, demon faces that she's been chewing on. Uh, yeah. right. No, don't tell Rufus that. Ruf Rufus can eat the rations, it's fine. Maybe he eats the human faces. He sort of just gives he gives Sneak a big old hug and he's like I'm glad you're safe. But seriously right. you've got loads of rations now anyway, because he gets dead. I'm asking you hey. I, I I'm I'm telling you all this right here and now. If I die again, do not try to bring me back. <laughs> it's not your choice. If I'm to being make. honest, we did actually yeah, try this true. time, but do not it, resuscitate. It do it not. Sort of happened. It was the old do not resuscitate. Idea. Yeah. Do, do not resuscitate. Seriously, I am owed my afterlife at this point. I could, I could write it on the bracelet that I have and put it on uh, Marisa's on wrist. Slap bracelet. Like. Yeah. <laughs> Marisa, your afterlife was going to be an Abishai. I am owed a better afterlife. I'm a good person. I think. You got the pogs now. I remember. Yeah, that's uh, true. When we gonna also, get technically, we didn't bring you back to life. We just made you remember When stuff. we get to find a bone devil with a Furby? <laughs> <laughs> oh, <can't wait. laughs> Please, oh my god. No, no, no. no you There's just find a long there, Furby. <laughs> oh, yes, please. Long Furby should be an enemy. No, Long Furby should be a friend. Uh, long Furby is a friend. It's called Truffles. Long Furby. <laughs> 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 Right. No. You just look over and Truffles has revealed their true form. They've been a Furby all along. So what's the plan then? We kill oh, Zaria. 
Yeah, that sounds good. Oh, I thought it was just yeah, a little bit stone. Kill Sariel. I thought you were going after the sword. The sword? Sword to kill Zariel. Oh. Yes. Speaking One of sword it, to but, rule her rules. But... <laughs> <laughs> Speaking of, I guess you could kill her with her own sword. Speaking, that of, would be so bad speaking of equipment, does anyone have any like spares, or did anyone pick up any of mine? Like I'm, I'm, I'm kind of like. Half well, naked. it's funny you should say that because I'm quite well sworded up right now. I say take your <laughs> pick. So doesn't Bam have like an actual equipment store in his hat? But, I'm pretty sure he does. Magnus, I am not taking my pick of your stuff. <laughs> Magnus is. You give me what I you don't need. I stole my stuff, though. I stole Hold it from on, my dead people. Do you have the ruses like alchemy stuff, or is that with Leoson? So I think Leoson's got it. Unless oh, one of no. you's I've got, got it in your inventory. Kids, though. Oh, that's, that's one of those is my ruses, I think. Um, here's, a herbal here's your herbalism kit. Leoson, I think, has your alchemy it's, stuff. He takes the herbalism kit and begins to, like, try and unwrap it, but he just can't. Oh, no. Because his hands are to... fucked up and different now. We need to rehab you. Oh, this is a problem. Um, oh, I should probably hide the traffic stuff. <laughs> Sorry, what? what? The traffic dust. Nothing. So, yeah, it's sad about Higa. <laughs> Just gloss over that. Yes, yeah, so Lewisin will be pretty sad to find that out. Um, I'm sorry if... If he was, but if we find Higa's devil form, we could do the same thing here. I don't that know would if Higa nice. would want us to do that. Aww. I didn't want you to do that, but you still fucking did it. This was not my choice. <laughs> no, we lost the rug for this. We could get that rug back. Mad Maggie's a good person. Yeah, She'll please. Return, won't you? Look at Maggie. She's a woman of her word, right? She never said she was going to give it back to us. She did say she was borrowing it. Oh. I'm going to turn into the D&D &D version of the Big Lebowski, where we're just on a quest for this damn carpet. Listen, you guys, I'm so tired of fighting. Like, can we just... Can we just not? Can we just... Go and lay on a carpet and Go... drink where did coffee? coffee? I don't know, you what did you hear? Yeah, they want their carpet back. Yeah, want their carpet carpet. back. <laughs> we did want our carpet back. <laughs> it really ties the room together. <laughs> she... The thing is off. You see Mad Maggie, and she's just like, oh, you, you guys have been through a lot. Sure, it'd be yeah. nice if you had, like, a nice carpet to relax yes. on. And she yes, leans back, really and the carpet weird. just kind of catches her as she drops back. <laughs> and she just kind of float, floats <laughs> lazily up into the air, like, like as if she's on a hammock, just, like, tilting back and forth. Right, um, I might put a call into the big man himself and cancel it. <laughs> Cancel a magic carpet subscription. <laughs> oh god! Oh, I'm, I'm here to report a crime. Yeah, account fraud. Oh. Mm -hmm. So, if you wish to find the bleeding citadel and Zariel's sword, I feel like we went over this. You need to find one of the fallen three, you remember? Maris is just looking at Bam like, what the fuck is going on? It's a good development, that's being said. Yeah. Don't worry about it. Exposition <laughs> dumps have happened. Seriously, though, you, you, you think putting, putting me into a new body would at least fucking grow my eye back? Like, come on, man. He's still got that the brand as well. Which, by the way, every time Sneak hits someone in the face of... Every time Sneak stabs someone in the eye now to kill them, I feel it now. I understand the <laughs> horrors you've went through. Oh. <laughs> That's going to be it. You're going to cripple two party members now every time you do that. Mm. <laughs> yes. It's, it's, it's also, quite... how did you breathe ice all the time? It ruins my lips. <laughs> I feel a lot warmer inside now, so maybe it's... Um... Maybe huh. I can't anymore. I don't know. By the way, this Marusa looks horrific compared yeah, to yeah, the he looks fucking Marusa. Terrible. Like he looks like the I got King picture. Doddy Darko rabbit. Yeah. Oh, He's cute. fucking terrifying. But... I like him though. Maybe we should put the mask of murder on you just to make you look a bit <laughs> Oh no. <don't laughs> when the mask say. of murder improves your appearance. <laughs> what what does the mask of murder look like? I don't think we ever said that. Pennywise's uh, face. There you go, there's a picture of... Numerous. Oh no, please, no thank you. 
Pennywise is cute. No. Let me get a new bro. picture of the it's new his brother, quarter intelligent. He just wants Holy to take you down to his nice bad. little sewer. Yeah, that's because no. I can't do scary things. There Disgusting. There he is, he's on the stream. Terrifying. Oh no, I just saw the Higa one. Mm. Yeah, Higa's dead. No. And if there's anyone to blame for this... It's... There's nobody to blame. It was McDonald's. Just I made it just in case. Yeah. I, I made it just in case the stone that dropped from magma was a diamond. <laughs> you oh, okay. <laughs> yeah. You're like, has got big plans. Yeah. Big plans doesn't want you to know. So yeah, mm. we need to find one of the three to get the sword. Yeah. yeah so you need to find. Uh, oh. Uh, she checks her notes. Some some pants would be nice. Uh, you you need to. Oh yeah, you are a bit indecent, aren't you? Yeah. And she, <laughs> uh, oh, she clicks God. her fingers, and you have common clothes on. Ah, uh, that... what's Piccolo's clothes beam? Of an appearance of your choice. Ah, uh... <laughs> and they fit around your tail as well, as Hood, you know. Have Hood, a tail hoodie and a snapback. <laughs> no. Um, <laughs> yes, please. I will tell you one thing though. His his tendrils. He immediately just ties them up in a man bun. <laughs> oh, that's pretty cute. Although oh, um, he's a hipster. Oh no, he's hot. Oh no. <laughs> and he's just like, oh, no, he's what he's getting in the way, slapping myself <laughs> in the other eye whilst I'm, I'm fighting or whatever. Um, <laughs> <laughs> that's probably why you lost the last fight. No, seriously. Um, like we were oh, getting right. our asses kicked. Seriously, I'm walking around looking like fucking Knuckles the Echidna. Like, what is that about? We are in full Knuckle mode. <laughs> oh yes, funny. Anyway, yes, it's please twin twin continue. Sonic we go? Bone. <laughs> 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 what Shadow Bone, which is where Zariel lives. Um, yeah. So you need to find either Harriman, Bell, Harriman, <laughs> Bell. <laughs> <laughs> Bell, like B E L. Like ding dong till the dead. And he's all winks. <laughs> What's so oh, funny man. about Bell? No, no, it's it's just, man. no, it's just. I know, that's what I'm laughing at. It's so funny. I love fantasy names so much. <laughs> Did you say Harriman? It's and like Bell? they're never just called David oh. or something, you know what I'm saying? You want to go and see David the Wise? <laughs> Uh, you need to... <laughs> yeah, all of us. I mean, your it's name like, is literally like Magnus. Go Magnus, the Holy Grail. Magnus is there an extremely normal call name. Call me. We're gonna go see Hammerman. Team. The enchant. It's, it's, it's basically it's Saruman, but with a H. Saruman. Yes, yes legally the state um, Saruman. Yeah. <laughs> uh, so you can either go see Haraman, Bell, or Alanthius. <laughs> <laughs> All of those seem. <laughs> Which one's closer? I, mean, I don't know. I have to just tell you how to get to any of them. No. Which one sounds the silliest? Let's go and see them first. <laughs> I mean, if 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 Bell turns out to be a <laughs> child, <laughs> we can call Question, him Baby Bell. Do Belle. we have one of the war machines? Who calls their child that? Oh, <laughs> someone in fantasy. Actually, Alanthius oh. changed his name when he was legally allowed to. <laughs> yeah, he was just called Bob. Yeah. Bob. Uh, <laughs> Steven. Uh, but you remember, Harriman and Alanthius are two of the Hell Riders that followed Zariel through. Uh, Alanthius is now a ghost. Ooh. And, uh, no, Alanthius, wait, hang on. Haraman is a Nazagon, and I think Atlantis oh is some form of. Oh, oh wow. my god, I was that so was scared. I was else. so scared. Wait, how do you spell that? M A. What did you think I said? Uh, we can't say it on Twitch. No. Something oh, okay. from a certain country that oh, was a part god. of a certain war. Oh my god. Oh, right. Oh. Yeah. Oh. oh. Yeah. 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 Wait, what? what he is wait, a he's a what? Servant of Zarya. <laughs> Now it makes sense. What, how is it actually it's, spelled? N A R Z U G O N. I love it. Why? Why would I they love... make it that close? I don't. I know, right? 
What does this mean? Because uh, we're in hell. That is, that is pretty bad. It's yeah. alright, this was written no. before World War II, don't worry about it. Oh, <laughs> it will make sense now. <laughs> Uh, I, I think it's like an old term that they've just read. I don't know, or it might have been made up. I don't know. Um, oh anyway, yeah, let's, let's not call it that. <laughs> it is a silly name. It's well, an dog. It's only a model. Yeah, he is an end dog now. It, it's Haraman anyway. His name is Haraman. Yeah, that is really worse. Andy, please. Andy. <laughs> oh yeah. Oh no. <laughs> no. <laughs> <laughs> All right, we're two for two on making really, really bad jokes. Oh, oh no! Why oh, are we so oh, no, badly behaved for Wednesday? At least my yesterday's was. Um, oh my god! <laughs> I think it's just you, Holly. What? <laughs> it's not just Holly. Wasn't me. even playing yesterday. I am the Holly. kid at the back of the bus. Hmm? Yeah, we're cancelling <laughs> truffles now. We're cancelling. We had Holly. a good run. We had a good run. No. Yeah. Yeah. Um, but I think right. uh, I think friends week. got an early morning, so I think we'll leave it there for today. Okie okay, dokie. Okay. Makes sense. <laughs> what? I didn't even get to do uh, any adventuring. You didn't. Yeah, yeah, time, next time, Grandpa. Damn you, Bahamut! No, it's okay, Grandpa. Next time. <gasps> this means I can be Bahamut again. You can. Bahamut. But also, Marisa. I it could have been anyway. Marisa's Look very upset eye. with Bahamut right now. <laughs> Yeah, I would imagine. Yeah. Follow up. Technically... Bahamut... Sorry. Even <laughs> Bahamut can't sever infernal contracts. Yeah, but he also didn't what want to. Shitty God can't do that. Yeah, what the hell? I can't imagine him doing that. You, you, you follow a man for forty years of your life <laughs> as a god. <laughs> And he can't even break can't an even infernal. Give you an can't even do a favor for you. He can't even send you to heaven. It's a good job. No. There's no real life parallels to that. Good. Yes. Yeah. Definitely. Yeah. Not. <laughs> yeah. That is good news. It's very. Unique. Oh, in the Bible. Mm. Yeah. It's, it's not like it's not like Maru's just hallucinated Bahama in his dying yeah, he moments. He probably could have, to be fair. <laughs> very real possibility. <laughs> he just went into the light. Right. Anyway, this was an interesting game, everyone. So spicy. Yeah, cheers for listening. So Anybody who did. So uh, well, Ted and Ken were both in chat. Um, I would have yeah, typed, cheers, but I guys. have blue fingers. I'm very and sorry. I also had another Wait, couple of blue, blue fingers. I have glue fingers. Oh, glue oh. fingers. I You've been touching blue. eager too much. No, no. I had blue as well. <laughs> oh, no, the hoops. Sorry. <laughs> um, Damn hooves. All right, podcast voice. Let's go. Oh, smurfs. Thank you for tuning in to the Six Tavern. Please join us next week when we continue our Icewind Dale adventure. Um, Yay. Investigating what seems to be a murder mystery. Ooh. Is that right, Callum? Yes. But will they be able to figure out the mystery before the Saver Company arrives? Probably, well, it? probably not. Anyway. <laughs> um. Oh shoot, we haven't had the bloody Twitter and the YouTube on the screen. Do, 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 it's right. okay. Do, well, do, uh, do, do, well, good job, they do, do exist. Do, 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 do. <laughs> um, uh, speaking of roundabouts, uh, please, no, this is completely irrelevant, uh, please give us a follow on Twitter at Mystic Tavern and at YouTube at Mystic underscore. No, wait, it's, it's at Mystic underscore Tavern on Twitter. And Mr. Kevin on, t- on YouTube. There we go. Got there in the end. Um, also, uh, no, that's it. Um, thanks, <laughs> thanks for joining us tonight. Uh, have a good evening. And please remember. Yep. Cheers for sync. Sorry about the delay starting. Please remember that the red caps in the verse are free. You can just take them. Oh, I was going to say you can just love yourselves, but that's good too. <laughs> Please remember, you don't want free lives. You could just take them. You could just take them. Yeah, you can just take them. They are free. You're don't coming with me now. Alright, bye. Bye-bye. Bye-bye. No, you hang